Hey superstars, I'm Sue and welcome to my channel Reviews with Sue. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and supporting our channel. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Sue and I hope you consider hitting that subscribe button. So would you like to know what today's unboxing is all about? Well, let me show you. It is the Willow Nook Box. And if you want to know what's inside this box, then just keep on watching. Doing reviews just like I do. Hanging out with your friend Sue. It's Sue. And I'm back. And I have the Willow Nook Box here for fall 2022. If you're not familiar with the Willow Nook Box, let me tell you a little bit about it. But first of all, guess what? It's brand new to my channel, Liz. I'm so excited I'm able to bring it to all of you guys. If you're not familiar with the Willow Nook Box, they've only been around for a couple of seasons from what I understand. I have been following them over on Instagram and some of their items are amazing. They show spoilers over there and... I'm thinking I'm going to like this box, you guys. This is the fall box. So it is a quarterly lifestyle and self-care subscription box. So the kind of items you might get is like some home decor items. You might get lifestyle items. You might get self-care items. You just never know. But this is going to be the fall box. And I haven't seen anyone unbox it yet. So I'm so excited to actually touch and feel all the items, even though I kind of know what's going to be in the box. Now, over on Instagram, they currently have a giveaway going on. Yes, you heard me right. A giveaway on Instagram. So you want to hop on over to Instagram, you definitely want to start following the Willow Nook box because you can enter the giveaway and I believe it's going to be a box like the one I'm going to share with you guys today. Now this particular box is $79 per season and it does have a $4.99 in shipping, which is totally reasonable you guys because this box costed a lot more than $4.99 to ship. Now since I am sharing this with all of you today, they gave me an awesome discount code. It is SUE10 and that is going to give you $10 off your very first subscription box. Now they also gave me a discount code of SUE15 and that's going to give you 15% off their shop. If you do have any interest in the box I'm going to share with you right now, I highly recommend that you do it sooner than later because you do have to order this by September 15th and they may just sell out. You just never know. If they do have any leftovers, they're going to put them in the shop and then you can purchase them as a one-off purchase. Now I don't know if you can use the discount codes on the boxes themselves, but on the individual items in the shop, you can use the SUE15 for the 15% off. You can follow them on Instagram. You can follow them over on Facebook. And if you do happen to go over to Instagram, let them know that Sue from Reviews with Sue says, hello, because you guys know I love to say hello to all my friends out there. So before we dive on into the box, I do want to give you just a little bit more information that I did receive from their website. Every three months, we carefully curate your Willow Nook box to perfectly complement the season and bring comfort and joy into your space. Our box will help you craft your home into a place where you are most content. In addition, to your curated items, each box will include a mixed media art print containing a seasonal recipe. Save each recipe in the collection or display your favorites for easy reference. Members of our community may submit an original recipe and if yours is chosen, your next box is on us and I think that is so cool. At Willow Nook, we are passionate about supporting artists and creators in our community. At least one item in every box is handmade and will be sourced directly from the small scale artisan. Over time, our goal is to grow our support of local creators and amplify their effects. So I am so flipping excited to get into this box right here. So let me go ahead and show it to you one more time before I actually cut the tape because I have not even done that so far. So this is what the box looks like right there. And then you can see they even have their own tape that you can see right there on the front. So now is the time we are diving in you guys. Yay. My first time opening this box and I is excited I am. So let me go ahead and cut the tape and see what what we find inside here. So let me get it. I'm trying still. I'm trying. So we are kind of like getting it open here. And ooh, is it jam-packed. And guys, this box was actually pretty heavy. Right on top, it says Willow Nook Box. How to open this box. Prepare your favorite warm drink. Put on your favorite music. Settle into your nook. Reflect and enjoy the moment. Open your Willow Box Nook. Be inspired. As the glow of autumn takes presence in our lives, it's time to reassess our goals and evaluate how the year has gone by. It's time to be thankful and cheerful. Autumn is when culpability takes center stage and breaking bread has been an inspiration for this box. Your surroundings are important in fostering an inner calm and peaceful environment that supports your well-being. Take this time to reflect and add a few touches to your home to help you embrace the current season. Use the items you received in this box to add warmth to your home and your heart. 
Celebrate the season and carve a little time for yourself. That is what the Willow Box is all about. So that is everything that was on this card here. And then on the back of the card, it goes over all the items that's going to be in the box, as well as the retail values, which I think is super cool. So let me go ahead and set this little card over here to my side. So now I'm going to show you the inner box. And this guy is kind of heavy, you guys. So this is what it looks like on the inside. You can see it has kind of like a burnt orange paper. And then it does say Willow Nook Box right there on a little sticker. So let's go ahead and break the tissue as in we're are going to be breaking some bread, I'm thinking, and see what we have inside. So the first item is this item right here. And it looks like we may have some type of a scarf maybe. So let me see if I can get into it and see what we have. Ooh, it is feeling soft, you guys. Oh, and I'm loving these colors. They're like burnt oranges and kind of like a beigey kind of a color. And now that I'm looking at the other side, guys, look it, it's like an ombre. I love it and look it, it has all these beautiful fringes right here. This is so soft and cozy. I have received one of these scarves in the past in a previous subscription box. And guys, they are so, so nice. They're soft, they're cozy, and they're actually really warm. I actually use mine as a lap blanket when I'm watching television. So let me show you, this is like half of it. So it is like really large. You can see this is the whole length of it. Hopefully you're getting like the whole picture here. And then you can see it does go all the way over to this ombre look. And then you can see all that beautiful fringe on the side. And this is only half of it. So I'm gonna lay it right here on my little lap right now because it is nice and warm and cozy and perfect for that fall season. So this has a value of $40. So the next item looks like it's going to pair perfectly with our little blankie slash scarf. This is the Mulling Spices by Twine Living Company, a festive blend of cloves, cinnamon, orange peel, star anise, and cardamom. And this is the item right here. This has a $20 value. It does tell us here on the back actually how to prepare it. And let me go ahead and cut open this because I do want to sniff it because, you know, I love to sniff things. So when we open it up, ooh, it's actually a loose leaf tea. So this is what the tea looks like right here you can see all the goodness inside there and oh my gosh oh my gosh, this smells so good. You know, do you ever like take those little um, bags and you put them in a boiling pot on the stove and you just like simmer it all day and it smells like the cloves and the cinnamons and just makes your house smell so good? Well, that's what this is going to do for you. Plus, you get to drink it, so it's like a twofer in this one. So let me go ahead and put this one down and dive on in. We have, oh, these are cute, 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 cute. Oh, my gosh, you guys, check this out. This is actually the Honey Bee Pot Holder and Trivet and Honey Bee Oven Glove in Mustard. It is by Rain and Humble, and it has a $20 value. Look at how cute this is. Rain and Humble, am I saying that right? This is the tag right there, and this would match any decor. So no matter if you have woods in your house or you have whitewash items, anything like that, this is definitely gonna match. And look, I can put my hand in there, and now my hand is going to be protected. So hello, everybody. And then it even came with a matching, yes, a matching trivet, or you can also use this to you know help lift things out of the oven super cute oh look at the back pattern on this one it has that beautiful you know straight lines through it that way or you can go with the little bumblebees that's on that side these two are so adorable and look it even matches my my little blankie here i have here on my lap still so those are those two items and they're 20 dollars for this set which is very reasonable okay then we have something here that is all wrapped up so let's see what it is she had everything in here perfectly strategically placed in this box. I'm telling you, you couldn't have fit anything else in here. Oh my gosh. Okay. I know guys. I'm so sorry. I'm always like, this is so cute. This is so cute. But you know, it is so cute because this is our next item here. And look at that little spoon right there. That's what I was actually looking at. Like, oh my gosh, this is by a mandatory activity. It's made in small batches. It's handcrafted. The Milky Way oatmeal, milk and honey milk bath. It has a $16 value. And this is what it looks like guys. And yes, it came with this adorable little scoop right there. I love it. Okay, so let me go ahead and open it up and see if I can take a little sip. Hopefully, I won't pour any out because I have to cherish every little drop of it. Ooh, ooh it smells good. 
oh my, I can't wait to pour this in my bath. So this is like in a powder form and this is the packaging. And it actually looks like a little milk jug right here or one of those old fashioned kind, you know, like back in the day when you used to have those like little doors and you opened it up and your milkman actually set it inside there and then you'd grab it and put it in your fridge. Well, that was actually before my time, but we did have one of those little trap doors in our house. So there's that item right there. Like I said, a $16 value. And then, ooh, -wee. okay, so we have this item right here and I think this is going to be our print. So let me go ahead and get into this. Now, this is the print where if you actually submit a recipe and you're part of the community, then you can be entered. And if your recipe is actually drawn, then you can actually win your next box for free. So in here we have, ooh, it's very well protected. Ooh, that looks good. Super spiced pumpkin bread. Recipe is by Liz Lewis, and it does give us all the ingredients, all the instructions. It came in a beautiful format. And then look, there is the little um, picture right there. So I don't know if she does the artwork or who does the artwork, but you can always frame this or you can just put it in your cupboard and pull it out when you want to use it. But this would actually be be really nice sitting in your kitchen and then you can change out the recipe each season so it goes over all the ingredients Ooh, streusel topping i'm all over that one this actually does have an 18 dollars value instructions uh, step by step and then the last step is enjoy so there is our print right there and that is gorgeous okay let me set that over here on the side and then it looks like we got something big in here and it says fragile so let me see if i can pull it out of the box it's like a box in a box so i am struggling just a little bit but we are going to get it out of here so yes the struggle was real as i always say but this box was actually inside the other box and it was very difficult to get out so i had to struggle a little bit but i do have it out now and now we're going to see what's inside this box that says fragile so let's go ahead and get into this and let me find my cutter because i didn't know i was going to need it again but i'm glad i am so here we go and let's see what it looks like now i believe this last item was going to have two different versions so you could have gotten an oval item or you could could have gotten a round item and it looks from the looks of it as i got the oval item oh my gosh it's more beautiful in person it really is let me remove some of the packing materials from here and some of these like little things right here and let me slide this over and this particular item that i'm about to show you is the toasty bread basket it's handcrafted 10,000 villages is who it's by and it has a 37 dollars value but look <gasps> tell me that's not gorgeous look at the weave in there it actually has like all these different rows here and then it has all this twine that goes around each one of them and then yes inside there's actually like a trinket tray not a trinket tray a trivic i guess you could say and oh my gosh it's made out of stone or plaster this is what the inside looks like so if you are baking bread you can actually just plop it in here but you can always put rolls on here you could biscuits on here you can use the basket even all by itself let me dump the rest of these guys out but you can even use the basket right here for something different and then you can use this separately if you wanted to maybe you could just use it as a trivet tray this had a 37 dollars value and i think it is totally worth it wow Wow, wow, wow. Have you ever seen anything this beautiful before? Let me show you all the way around. And like I said, I believe there are two different versions. Some might get a round one and some might get an oval. I don't believe you get to choose. I think it's just going to be pick of the draw, basically. And whenever your box goes out, you'll find out when it gets to you because that's going to be your surprise. So let me do a quick little recap. Here we have our basket. We have the little trivet that's on the inside. We have our milk bath right here. Yes. We have some nice tea tea. Then we also have the print that is right over here. And then we also have the oven mitt as well as the trivet, or you can use this as like an oven mitt as well. And then on my lap is this cozy ombre scarf right here from All About Love. I loved this box so much. Please let me know in the comments down below what your favorite items I received in my box today. I'm going to tell you right now, it is going to be, yes, this basket and the little tray that goes inside it. I want to thank the Willow Nook box again so much for sending over this box of goodies to me. I can't wait to start playing with everything. I'm definitely feeling the fall vibes here. Now, don't forget, you can head on over to Instagram and follow the Willow Nook box because they do have that Instagram giveaway going on. And if you want to receive a box just like the one I opened, because I think that's what it is, then you definitely should be entering that one. And you can also follow me over there. It's Reviews with Sue. What I like to do over on Instagram is post some of the pictures of the boxes that I open here on the channel. And then I show me over there with all the makers that make them and tag them. So then that way they get credit where credit is due. 
I do have a giveaway myself, so make sure you check my description box below for that. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? It's free and it's not going to cost you anything. A like on this video on your way out would be great. And other than that, that's all I have for you guys today. So please be safe, be well, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!